came out with the title Five Pillars, One Roof and I mean, We tossed and it around. Why. We tossed it around a lot in the meetings, you know, we yeah. tossed it around a lot. And I remember that what led to the title was us saying, you know, what do we really want the audience to think about? You know, and, and as we were being told that it was about, you know, what will you defend and, you know, about making choices rather than about learning things, you know, we realized, okay, so the five pillars are not the focus. You know, and if it's not about the five pillars, then what is it about? You know, and then you think, all right, what do pillars do? You know, pillars hold up a roof. So there's the message. The message is, what is this roof? You know, and what will you defend? You know, right? And so it just naturally evolved. Mm. And then we decided, okay, lah, let's make it the title. You know, it makes the audience start to think beyond pillars. The idea is, before they watch the show, they have to, they have to be curious about, okay, what is beyond the pillar? Mm. What is this roof? We've never heard the word roof before, right? Mm. 25 years down, yeah. no one's mentioned the total defense roof. Yep. So that's what this half hour musical will tell you. Mm. Okay, so finally, <clears throat> having gone through the process of writing the musical and just you soon put out your message. Personally, what does total defense mean to you? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what will you defend? <laughs> Actually, all I said in the, in the musical itself, you know, what we want to say is really in the musical itself. So mm. what, the message in the musical is both personal and mm. well, <coughs> bigger I mean, than that. Well, I mean, okay, you know, having almost come to the end of this journey, you know, yeah. it's less than a week away from, you know, mm. the actual show. And of course, we hope the show will, you know, have a life beyond that. But what I've realized is that this is our part to play, you know, as creators, as artists. This is our defense, you know, right? So in the joke, yeah, in the show, there is something called musical defense, but we're, it's, it, we're joking. Yeah. But but I wrote that in because we half mean it. <laughs> Those of us who do this, we have we have a responsibility to sometimes do it for the greater good. It's our you know? contribution, yeah. in a way. You know? I mean, different people contribute in different ways. Like, just now, in a way, as well, people always say that, like, I, I was from NDC, musical drama company, serving my national service. And people are saying, well, why are you dancing or singing away? And I say, that's part of yeah. what I do as well, because we entertain the troops to mm. boost their morale, you know. And as artists now, we are contributing to the economy in different ways. Mm. You know, we are contributing to people's confidence and, and making them feel good. And in a way, it's kind of like a psychological defense as well. Yeah. Mm. So yeah. This, this whole show is, is really a demonstration of how, you know, people with specific skills, you know, right, the people who sing, who dance, who act, yeah. are all coming together to yeah. play their part collectively, you know, yeah. as a group, to further the message, you know. Yeah. In itself, putting this show up is showing you how we can play a part. You know, how does a, a, a yappi who sings part-time in a a cappella group contribute to passing on the message yeah. by being part of this show? You know, how does MDC yeah. step up? You know, how do a, a bunch of CHIJ choir girls contribute? You know, and it's about... And, and what, what, what surprised us is that you find the, the, the role you, th you get to play is not necessarily the role you always thought you would. Mm. Yeah. Singaporeans think, oh, I've done my NS. I'm, I'm still doing reservice. Okay, I've done my part. No, every single day you wake up and there's something else you do in your life. How is that part of Total Defense? As he composes music, as I write scripts, as they perform, we're already doing it. Mm. You know, you just need to shift your mindset and understand the larger purpose of what you're doing, yes, and that yeah. becomes total. Yeah. By doing this, I'm doing my part. In there you go. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you know? It's thank true. You it's true. Thank you thank very you. much. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I am only one person. Say to soda. I am only one person. What's a shaker? And this year's message seems to have struck a chord with Singaporeans from all walks of life. From students to military men to musicians, all have come together to put up a good show. More used to playing the guitar, musician Sarah Wee steps up to play an overseas graduate who worked and played in New York. But nothing comes close to home. Okay, Sarah, um, firstly, how do you feel about being part of the musical um, Five Pillars, One Roof? I think it's great. I really enjoy myself and I think it's a great experience altogether. So, yeah, I'm, I'm loving it. Yeah. Okay, I understand that you, you, you sing, right? But um, 
how different is it like seeing for in, in, like in a live band and then singing in the musical? Um, you you both uh, you're singing to audiences, but I think it's a very different approach where. For my usual work, uh, live gigs, we do tend to interact a lot. It's a very light-hearted event, but I think for this, it's where you are taking the audience. You know that they're there, but you're not really acknowledging them. So it's a very different stage presence altogether. Yeah. Then um, acting is it new to you? Because obviously, musical, you both, you know, the expression has to come out in the face while it's you're singing. Very, it's very new to me. Uh, I've only done it once, so this is the second time. I uh, can't say that I'm a great actor, but I'm trying my best, lah. Yeah. Okay. Um, personally, when you think of total defense, okay, what comes to mind? Keeping your family safe, keeping the country safe, um, being very aware of what's going on around in the world, in your country especially. Yeah. And then there is Ideal Amin, the veteran in the Singapore Armed Forces Music and Drama Company, plays a middle-aged man who has witnessed the progress of Singapore. I tell you, when my father passed away, my mother had to raise four children all by herself. You know, she was close. While no stranger to the big stage, Ahmad says this performance is something quite different. I've been in MBC for I think what 16 years. Right. Um, how is this? Um, How does this musical add to sort of your performance portfolio and with uh, MBC? Since actually this is supported by the government, actually it's much much uh, bigger than what uh, I've been doing so far. Uh, besides doing all the the musicals outside, but this is something that is um, much more important to me because it, it talks about the, the the those the olden and the younger generation get the learning what is actually total defence all about. Yeah. Is it a totally different experience altogether performing with the MDC itself and like a totally different group of people? Of course, it's different because these people somehow we have a lot of students involved in this and then. When we are into, go into a character, especially when we get angry, especially like my case, I have to shout at them. The kids got scared of me. <laughs> yeah. They're not army boys, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's why. I'm, I now that Jonathan asked me to even look at their face and really score in front of them. I'm not sure what's going to happen the next time. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay, so to, I mean, you've obviously um, total defense is nothing new to you, but you know, it's been 25 years and you've been with MDC for 16 years. Right. How do you think this year compared to? Previous? Actually, for this year, it's more challenging because um, I, I'm allowed to play a role, and that this role is something that actually I wanted so much because you know uh, you can sing and you can um, uh, be in character, and you make the character so alive that you know people can relate to. It's more important than just simply say those lines, and then you can't even feel anything. But this is something for me. This is different. And finally, there is jazz singer Rani Singham, who acts as the voice of conscience. Hi, Rani. Um, how do you feel when you were first approached to do something for Total Defence? I was actually quite um, happy to do it, but um, a little concerned about time because I just had a baby about five months ago, so that was my only <laughs> concern. But otherwise, I was very excited. After I was told what the concept was like and you know what to expect in the musical, most people know you as a jazz singer. Yes. So what has the jazz singer got to do with Total Defense? Oh, I'm I'm also Singaporean, <laughs> so I think the production and the whole idea of Total Defense uh, involves all Singaporeans, Singaporeans from all walks of life, and uh, that's what you will see in the musical as well. You know, people from different sectors, different. Um, Parts of their life, you know, doing different things, uh, young kids to the uncle and auntie, and and the jazz singer. Yeah, I had a I had the privilege of watching the rehearsal just now, and you actually sang in uh, Mandarin. Yep. Um, is it your first time? How hard? How hard uh, is it? Well, no, I've I've sung a couple of uh, Mandarin songs before, whether in choir or you know even uh, solo as a soloist, but not this Teresa Ting song. So. This was the first time, and plus it had been given a jazzed-up uh, treatment. So But that's your forte, right? <laughs> exactly, it was perfect because I think they wrote the whole show bearing in mind what I could do, and you know, giving me that uh, ability to present my jazz skills. <laughs> okay, maybe let's give you another opportunity to present oh. your jazz skills. Right? Um, <laughs> could you just sing us like yeah. a song to you that best represents total defense, like? Jazz style. Oh, you want me to? Okay, we can swing this uh, in swing. Um, I don't know if you remember this. Um, There's a part for everyone. 
In this land where we belong, there's a part for one and all to keep the peace we want. This 